Everyone has heard the negatives about Africa, malaria, poverty, power shortages, but not everyone has seen Africa the way that I have, and my Africa is not the one you've seen on the news. My Africa is Ghana, a place of welcome, Accra, a place of diversity with great highways, museums, and theaters, things that many do not associate with this land. There are markets filled with tourist trinkets and goods to be purchased. My university is one of the best in West Africa and has roughly 20,000 students. Kumasi, a town in the central region, a place with the friendliest cab driver I have ever met. The beauty of Lake Bosom Tree and the power of its history. The artisans who spend their days making kente, the most beautiful fabric I have ever seen. Adafo, on the coast, where the Volta River meets the Atlantic Ocean, a sight which fills you up inside. Even the village dogs are unable to resist the wonder. The lushness of the palms by the cool flowing river to the starkness of the sand where the ocean relentlessly beats away. Tomale, in the north. Less westernization, less civilization. We went for the elephants, for the safari. Instead, we found a rich Islamic influence and a mosque more simply elegant than any other. We found smiling faces and that games could be played without a common language. We got to see the beauty that comes from a place where makeup isn't used. Water is precious and laughter is always free. The Africa that I know is filled with smiles. It has beauty. It has more color than any place I've ever seen. With people willing to go out of their way to care for you. With strangers who offer sanctuary. It has people of all different races, from all different backgrounds, who will always share a drink with you on Saturday night and breakfast Sunday morning. My Africa is filled with adventure and humanity.